TLC's Sister Wives is returning for its 18th season, and with three of the marriages ending, things are more complicated than ever. There's no question, Robin. He's done with me. Cody's first wife, Mary, opened up about the moment that led to the two of them deciding to end their relationship. It was actually, uh, this is actually on our anniversary about a year and a half ago, um, where we were out on a drive and we just started having a, a real conversation. And, you know, he said some things that I hadn't heard come from his mouth to me specifically um, yet, and he finally was able to be open. He was finally able to like open up and be real with me, I think. And I was in a place that I could hear it as well. Mm -hmm. And so from then we just started having more real conversations. I think the conversations were a long time coming. So that was good. You know, it was not something that I ever saw happening in my marriage, especially, you know, like when we got married, like 33 years ago, like you don't think that that's ever gonna happen, but I'm very confident knowing that I did everything that I could do. And I'm very at peace with the, the timing of it and how it all played out. Mary discussed the infamous catfishing incident and just how much of a role it played in her split with Cody. I'm gonna clarify something here, and this is what a lot of people really misunderstand and that is the fact that um a lot of people look at the catfishing as a defining moment of the demise of our marriage um or even the family and it's really not because there was a lot of things that were happening for years prior um so to look at that moment as the thing that broke the marriage is very inaccurate so um, you know, we we have spent a lot of years since then um, having discussions, avoiding discussions, you know, not not really being in a place that uh, specifically about me and Cody, yeah. um, not really being in a place that I feel like that we could really talk and hear what the other one was saying, you yeah. know, so I think the passing of time and all those years since then, he and I have really been able to come to a place that we can just be more open and honest with each other. Whereas, you know, five years ago, 10 years ago, 15 years ago, we couldn't have done that. Mary also revealed that she's ready to think about dating again. I definitely am open to it. I definitely am open to it. You know, I've, I've lived many years as, you know, a very strong, independent, solo person. I don't want to live the rest of my life solo. So yeah, I'm definitely open to it. I'm probably not going to go with another plural marriage. <laughs> I mean, I, I had a, and I have, you know, a great family, um, but it's probably not going to go that direction for me. While there may be plenty of uncertainty in the coming months, Mary said she's really excited about the future. There's a lot of things that are still unknown. Um, and that's okay. <laughs> and I have to tell myself often that that's okay, that things are unknown because I do believe that they will come to me at the time that they're meant to come to me. Um, but I also have a lot of control, like a lot of things that I can control. Um, and I'm really excited for those things. I've got another really exciting uh, project coming along. I've got good people surrounding me. I've got an awesome support system and, you know, just kind of being open to what the future holds. You know, we don't know what's going to come in the future. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. You know what I mean? So it's just about, for me, it's really just about keeping all the doors open and saying yes. You know, because if you don't say yes, you always wonder what's going to happen. For more with the stars of Sister Wives, pick up this week's issue of People on Newsstands Friday.